Hey guys, I'm Fallen Blanks. Welcome back to Let's Play Super Mario Maker 2 Story Mode. We are getting there. There's so many levels that we've already completed. So much so that just getting to it is actually getting kind of like annoyingly long. So Invincible Wind Sprinter, which looks like the last level that the Taskmaster, like kind of a regular level that this game will give me. It is a four star. We're in for a clear night in a starry sky, but a strong wind advisory is in effect. Snag a superstar to run across the spike traps and use the wind to your advantage. Dash with Y and you might be mistaken for a shooting star. That was looking to be a, a fun one. Lots of dashing superstar, which means invincibility. And Mara 3, so immediately the best style of level. So, good. See what we got. Oh, jeez. Alright. Oh, let's be one of those levels. Oh, shit. Okay, good. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, oh, damn. Wow, that was trollish. How dare you. Well, I just don't want to get a game over. That's, like, my, kind of my goal in terms of the diff difficulty for this game. Ooh, they're going to be running fast enough for that. Okay, shit. Maybe I shouldn't jump at, like, full, full jump power every time. Luigi, I know you're going to say something. Don't even. Don't even. Just oh, yeah. don't. Okay. Okay, ooh, that was a nice jump. Okay, phew. Uh, ah, that's such horseshit. Wow. That's like really, really trollish for a Nintendo level. Oh man, I don't know if I'm gonna make this. Ah shit. Ah, okay, good. Okay, right here. Come on, oh, okay. That yeah, okay, good. Cause that 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 was really lame putting that muncher there, and like it's basically like guaranteeing that you're gonna die the first time you play through this level. Other than that, very fun. I do like those types of levels where it's like, you better maintain your speed because you're going to die because the superstar is going to wear off. And that's kind of fun. You want jobs? I got jobs, do you? Because I've done all your jobs. All right, I guess we get to do other character jobs. So we got Chain Chomp Chiller from Undo Dog. Arf, arf, I have a job for you. The path I usually take for my dirt a daily walk is littered with Chain Chomps. Could you show me it's possible to walk through these without jumping? It's a four star. <laughs> this is going to be difficult. Um, oh, man. So it's not too, too, too crazy. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, God. <laughs> Yay is right. All right, cool. Yep, fine. Fine. Ah, oh, damn. The slope really slows you down. No problem. No problem. It kind of reminds me of the, um, the chicken robots in Mega Man 2 and Woodman stage. Just gotta get that timing, man. That's all. Okay. Boy, that was close. Awesome. All right. Just got to make sure to not jump. Oh, shit. Uh... Oh, God. Wow. <laughs> Without being able to jump, I really, like, freak out. Because, like, my my hand would normally just be right at that jump button. Screw off. Actually, I guess I could use an, a mushroom. And that's, like, that would really help out here. But, not going to try to do that. Going to do each stage legitimately. If I get a game over on one, that'd be different, I guess. So, let's just see if I can just... Okay. There we go. Oh, perfect. Hopefully it's not too long a level. Oh, snake. Okay, cool. Oh, jeez. This could be bad for the heart. Okay, oh, God. It's a lot lower to the ground than I thought it was going to be. Ah, damn. This is to make sure it'll get onto the snake block. That's pretty clever. Because it's like, oh, well, if I, if I go this far, the chain shop will spawn earlier. Oh, man. Okay. Yeah, there we go. That wasn't bad. Oh, God. Ah! <laughs> I saw it coming, too. Oh, shit. Oh, okay. At least I know what I'm doing. Definitely a trial and error level for me so far. Okay. Hey, Bella. Bella's coming, coming and joining me. Yay. I love the yays. There we go. Hey, Bella. There we go. I like the idea of the snake, though. You know what I mean? Like, you always gotta keep moving. There we go. 
Easy enough. Easy enough. Let's see if I can de like spawn him too early. Nope. Yeah, he's gonna make it. Good planning, Nintendo. You know what you're doing. For the most part. Yeah. So I tell you guys, uh, I do a lot for you guys because today is also the day that Fire Emblem Three Houses came out, and my wife's gonna be playing that like crazy. One second. Yeah, there we go. This is mine now. Oh god. Um, my wife is gonna be playing that game like crazy, and yet I'm doing this for you guys. Oh god. Because I won't really get a chance to play the game once she gets home tonight. But I was like, well, I gotta record. Uh, even though I've got a, a few levels, or sorry, a few episodes done. Nice. That was fun. Uh, I have a few episodes done anyways, but I was like, whatever, I still need to record stuff. I, I kind of take advantage of that. My wife works when I'm at home, then I take advantage to record an episode or two. That way, I have a couple for you guys, so it, you know, too, it's not too crazy. Uh, reset dress, you know, like I don't go on too long without an episode. Though, uh, to be honest, I put up an episode today, uh, the day that, you know, this, this, the, that, the day I'm recording this, but I forgot, like, to put it up yesterday, so it's like, shit, it's already a day late. Molten Rain, that's by the Eraser. Your target this time is seven lava bubbles. What's that? You don't know how to take out a lava bubble? You want to pack your lunch, too? Don't worry so much, amigo. You'll figure it out. You're a sassy eraser. So, he's an eraser. I'm assuming that means that all his levels are about defeating enemies. So, that makes sense. To me, it does, anyways. And he did say your target this time. He's taking a jump now. Wow, I love this cloud area. That really, looks really cool. Oh, jeez. Uh, easy enough. I mean... There we go. That was easy. Eh, too, well, too late. I can go for that 10, but it doesn't really matter. Wow, that was... That was very, very easy. But I'm assuming that's also just like a, uh, a test to see what we're willing to do. And now it's like, your prey will be much, much more than that now. As we're a kid, I'm off with those blocks. Oh, off those blocks now? Oh, damn, damn it. Oh, no, don't do that. Oh, God. He's erasing himself. That is terrifying. Oh, I was not a fan of that. Oh, is he dead? Adios. Oh, you're back. That was weird. Hey, what's in here? Did they just go to the other side? No, you're underground. Oh, damn. Huh. Very cool. Well, what the hell? Oh, my God. There's going to be all sorts of characters. Who knows how many levels I've left to do. Hello, block thing. You are terrifying. What do these do? Okay, nothing. Hello. Hello. Patrick. Okay. Patrick. Have time for a job? There's something good in it for you. All right. House of exclamation blocks. We're in the market for a new house. We need someone to inspect this place we found. Hit the exclamation blocks and climb to the top to check it out. Also tilt L down. Or the L on the ground pound. All right. Okay. Okay, then. Jeez, that thing's kind of terrifying. But also means, like, are there other blocks that are alive? I mean, in the original Mario's canon, all the blocks and stuff are originally, like, Mushroom Kingdom citizens that Bowser turned into uh, blocks. So every block is a living creature, but now it's now it's just gotten ridiculous. Thank you. Boink, 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 boink. <laughs> oh, I like that. That's cool. <coughs> but now I can just ground pound. Love the ground pound. Oh, that was a lot less than I thought it would be. This is going to be fun. <laughs> Way too fast for you guys. Damn bullet bills. Yeah. Oh, how do I do that? Oh, cool. Oh, it's going to hit it. Ha! And now I can wait and I can go down that pipe. That's really friggin' clever. Oh, I like that a lot. I like that a lot. Get out of my way. Hurry up. Come on. Yeah. Huh. <laughs> I would never thought of that. There's so many things I would never have thought of, to be honest. There's... Nintendo's, like, way smarter than I am. It's, it's almost like this is why they do this job, and I don't. <laughs> Not smart enough at all to make fun Mario levels. I used to make games. I used to make games when I was a kid. They were almost always Mario games. They were, they were very... Like, when I was a little kid. I'm talking, like, six and... Like, six to ten or whatever. But, uh... My games I would make for fun were very rarely anything but Mario games. They weren't uh, anything original or anything like that. Oh, dang. Oh, I get it. 
Um, then when I got a little older, I started to make my own kind of things. Um, I had, like, an RPG that I made a long time ago with RPG Maker. That was, like, my major creation for the longest time. That's really a kid of time. I did a few other things, though. I remember uh, designing a uh, game for the DS when the DS first came out, which was going to be a, a hack and slash... Uh, it reminded me of Mega Man Zero. It was like a hack and slash platformer where you control your character with the um, with your left hand uh, on the analog or the analog. So on the directional pad, up would be jump, um, and then uh, you'd use the stylus for your sword swipes. I don't know. Never went anywhere. It's not like I had a DS, uh, you know, uh, kit to like work on or anything like that. Thank you. All right, I'm gonna make something good. Buildy, buildy, roo, roo, miracle, roo. All right, that's a thing he said. Oh, dang, it's over there at the castle and the red toad's like I don't pay attention I put a special mm, block somewhere wink you're creepy Patrick you got any more jobs for me I have another job for you the reward is particularly good darkness ahead darkness below we were thinking about buying this new property but they haven't turned the electricity on yet Could you take a look at the basement and tell us how spacious it is you need a spacious basement I know because I'm recording from my spacious basement right now it's not that spacious it's good it's got like it's got one main room, it's got, um, oh dang, it's got, um, the little closet beneath the stairs, uh, it's got another room that could easily be, like, a, a good rec room, that's my wife's sewing room for her cosplay, though she's very nice, and my, my game room is bigger than that, so she's very kind to me. It's over here. Ah! Oh god. Oh, I'm in the basement now. That makes sense. Oh, it's a mushroom, okay. Uh, and then there's these, like, we, it's, it's like the rec, not rec room, the storage room. It's like, you know, the, the room that everyone has that's like, it's just the, the, the cementy kind of floor and it's where you put a lot of stuff. <laughs> you know what I'm talking about. That's where the kitty litter is. And then, uh, like, a downstairs basement that also has a washer and dryer. Pretty good in my opinion. I like it. Um, it's a climb, I guess. I did it! I got the monies. It's like I tell the guy, it's like, your your house is very nice. Um, it's very spacious. I stole all the money from it. Probably should have done this job yourself, maybe. Oh, hello. Goodbye. Oh, want that. Goodbye. It's a cool level. I don't. I like how it's not the really dangerous flooring, but it is something you have to pay attention to, so that's pretty cool. It's going to be up here. Yeah, of course. I like this. This is really cool. Most of the levels I've been liking, though, to be honest. Yeah, saw that coming. That was really dumb of me, to be honest. Ding dong. Cool. All right. Oh, there we go. There's probably stuff down there, but what ends? Oh, that looked like a little thermometer. I like that. That was cool. I like just the uh, the very highlighted flagpole there. You know, as a kid, you can go back and view it, but the, the flag that you grab there, it's a peace sign. At least I assume it is. I always thought it was, uh, when I was a little kid, I thought it was a beetle. I don't know why. Well, I didn't, okay, I didn't think it was a beetle. I knew very well it wasn't a beetle. I just thought it looked like a beetle. So, whatever. All right, I'm gonna make something good. Buildy, buildy, roo, roo, miracle, roo! Which is now my favorite saying. I put a hidden block somewhere. Your hint is red flower. I wonder where it, where it is. I like this guy. I'm gonna keep doing levels for him. I have one last job for you. It comes with a special outfit. High atop Thwomp Tower. We finally found a place that we love, but it's been infested by thwomps. They're having quite a time with it. Uh, quite the time of it. Thwomping about wherever they please. Could you please survey the damage they've done? All right. Last level for this guy, and they'll get me a... Nice little outfit to wear for my little, my, my me character, my builder. Right now I've got the animated um, uh, hoodie on that has like Mario running from Mario World. It's actually pretty cool. Oh, this is the level you like? Oh, God. But this is Mario 3D World, which means you can actually jump on thwomps. Jump on thwomp! Woo! All sorts of things are going to be possible when you jump on thwomp. Do you want to be cool? Do you want your neighbors to like you? Then jump on thwomp! As you can see here, this professional jump on thwomper is jumping on thwomps and everything's going his way. I really should be doing more, uh... Oh, okay, he goes down. Probably a little left, right? I really should do more, um, infomercials. Sort of my calling. And you too can jump on thwomp for two easy payments of $29.99. Oh god, I'm dead. <laughs> There's the freaking flag or the um, checkpoint right there and I was like I should probably s stop and wait oh well, more money's for Phil can I ah oh. I was hoping I could go in the pipe but I can't go fast enough to even move forward while that guy's going uh, to the left or yeah to the left there so this is the place you guys want to move in 
And it's not like they're doing any real damage. Actually, I guess where I died, there's a lot of damage. They broke a lot of the uh, bricks, so I get it. I get it. Patrick, it really doesn't look like this place is going to be good for you and your family. Just that we... I don't know if it technically means his family, but whatever. Yep. Alright, let's do this. Wait. Oh, shit. Ah, okay, good. That went alright. Yeah. You gonna go to the right? You are? Yay! And it's underwater, so it's like slightly slower like that. No, oh, God. 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 <laughs> oh, cool. Oh, shit. What a great idea for a level. This is particularly neat. Ah! Oh, God. Wow, it actually hit me, but it didn't kill me. It actually pushed me out of the way. That's crazy. Oh, these are just regular ones. Can I still jump on them, though? Yeah. Yeah. That was awesome. Definitely, like, much harder. Like, I'm, I'm, I'm lucky that that didn't kill me at the end. That easily could have killed me at the end. Be very proud of yourself, Mario. Yeah. I like the little dance there. It's when you beat a, a castle in Mario 3D World. Which is really fun. I should play on this channel. And I'll make my way up there soon. And by soon, I mean, like, six years. Yeah. Almost enough to buy some more stuff from Toadette. Pardon me. Thank you for the helps. I have no more jobs for you. No problem. I will jump on you now. Nope, I cannot jump on you. Wow. Okay, then. On we go. Let's go back. Um, so red flower is that, that block. I can still do more jobs for you, I believe, which will get rid of those blocks. But I kind of want to wake up this guy, but I also want to see what that those things that I got were. So I want to check that out. And Oh, it's right here. Oh, it's just coins. Is this infinite coins? Oh, no. Okay. That was not great. But whatever. Um, let's go see the red flower. Bark, bark. Oh, yeah. Did I, I did your things. You have no more. Bark, you already all that stuff to do? I want to tell you a funny joke for a hundred bucks. All right. All right. All right. hundred bucks for a funny joke. Thanks. Here I go. Why are question mark blocks so good at holding power-ups? Because they have so much room inside. <laughs> that was actually pretty good. I can appreciate that. Oh, yeah, Mara. Okay, so there's no red plant. Oh, I'll do that another time uh, when I find it. Right now, I want to wake up the toad, though. I have enough time for one more episode, I believe. Let's wake you up. Yes, let's wake him up. Pow block wake up call. I don't want to name names of a certain yellow coworker isn't pulling their waiter here at the build site. If you want to, if you were to hit some pow blocks, you might be able to wake this nameless toad. I know a place that has a bunch of pow blocks flying around. So what do you say? Do you say flying around or lying around. Also, do they even have names? Because I mean, the guy said like, yeah, my name's Purple Toad. My family didn't love me. Oh, kill all spinies. Is that what it said? Kill all spinies. Kill all humans. Oh, the dogs are running around upstairs. Oh god, there's so many things. Oh my god! No, oh, jeez, okay. Oh, it only kills the top one. That's interesting. And there's the uh, the angry sun. Come on down. Come down. Oh god, he's coming down. Is that it? Wow, that was short and sweet, I guess. And goodbye! Now that I've killed Spinies, I must be off. Mario is a menace. J. Jonah Jameson should be like, That Mario is a menace! Let's walk around the Mushroom Kingdom! He's... Hitting thwomps and Jay, he's jumping on thwomps. He did that last level. Get me pictures of Mario. That's my uh, J.K. Simmons impression. It's not very good. I'll probably have to tone that down in the uh, post production. It was probably too loud, so I apologize. Oh, yellow toad. That is a long yawn. Long yawn. Is that it? You gonna say anything? Nope. All right, bye. No, I guess he got a job, but we won't do that job today. But I do want to talk to him. Who is the cast done yet? Anywho, we are calling now. I couldn't get my hands on the stone that the chief wanted, so I took an apple's head. Oh, on that note, could you bring me back some stone? Let's see, yeah, I think this will do it. Well, we'll do that next time, I guess, or whatever it is. It doesn't really matter. Uh, we'll do some more jobs next time on... Fi uh, well, that's me. I'm filling the blanks. Next time on Super Mario Maker 2 Story Mode. I'm filling the blanks. Take care, guys.